Yo, check this out bro, Masjid Al Haram right over here in Medina Yo, what's up guys, and welcome back to my vlog, how you guys doing? I hope you guys are having an amazing day bro Today is finally the day we are going to Medina bro It's like 7 or 8 o'clock right now at night time Dawood just went ahead and rented a car bro He rented a big freaking monster truck We're gonna be going to Medina inshallah We're gonna reach there at like 12, 1, 3, 4 a.m. Something like that, I don't even know bro But we're gonna reach there pretty late So as soon as we get there, we're gonna probably knock out Check so we're getting this bag right here We have ihram and stuff inside Because once we're coming back from Medina, we're gonna do Umrah, you know So yeah, we got that and for me i only got this bag right here bro what the hell is this i have my laptop inside i have a couple of clothes inside and stuff like that yo we are going to medina bro what are you talking about how you feeling bro you got that ice oh my god bro i got that ice as well look at that oh my god my ring looks so good bro looks way better than your freaking 20 dollar fake watch <laughs> Yo, check out this big car that Dawood rented, bro, right here. Bro, this car is like a freaking big car. Acha. We're going to Medina at night time, so I won't even be able to record anything, bro. It's all darkness. But let me show you guys the car, bro. Look at this. Yo, this car is big as hell, bro. There's a freaking back seater here as well. There's a driver's seat right over there. Because, you know, without the driver's seat, you can't drive the car. Can you shut the f*** up? This guy's trying to fix the seat. He's acting like he knows what he's doing, even though he's so confused right now. Look at that. Look at that. He doesn't know what he's doing. Bro, we are struggling to make the seat go back over here. All right, guys. We're like 10 people in this car right here. So, we're gonna... I'm about to get inside the car. If we stop anywhere, I'm gonna pick the vlog back up. But as of right now, I can't vlog anything. So, see you guys once I'm done. Yo, we just stopped by this freaking huge petrol station, bro. There are so many shops and everything here. I'm gonna go over there. I need to buy me some stuff. I'm getting kind of hungry, bro. So I want to go buy me some chocolates or something like that. El Qaswa Markets and Bakery. Yo, bro. What should I get, bro? What should I get? What should I? There's, there's so much to choose from. Like I literally don't know. Should I just get myself one, one of this right here? Nah, that's too much. You know, what, bro. I'm gonna get myself one of this milk right here. If you guys remember, and from my last vlog, and I'm gonna get like a lot of these juices right here for the rest of the people in the car. Check out, guys. I got like a dozen juices right over here. Yo, I also got this Lay's chip right over here the orange one you know the one that tastes the best bro i also got our 24 packet water right over here because you know you might need water four to six days later <sighs> yo guys it's like two hours later right now we just stopped by at another petrol station everyone's going to the washroom i'm the only one and i got a message on whatsapp i'm the only one that didn't go because you know i didn't drink water like them so i don't have to go to the washroom you know but we might stop ahead to buy some stuff maybe maybe inshallah bro there are so many people here bro what in the world i feel like i woke up in a different planet bro anyway let's see what else i can get over here bro i feel like eating something sweet bro it's like some chocolate or something like that all right bro you know what i'm getting myself this right here five hours later yo oh my god bro after freaking being on the road for like seven hours something like that i don't even know how long bro we finally made it to the place we made it to our aunt i mean our uncle's place bro he lives over right over here you know we come visit him every once in a week or something like that bro he's our you know he's literally our best friend something like that you know so yeah bro it's like 3 a.m something wait let me check the time i was asleep so i don't know what the time is it's 2 30 a.m as you can see right here we just made it over here let's go up pancha group group bro there's so many lights here it's messing up my lighting but yo we are in freaking medina bro let's go yo check your check out your boy bro you got his tourist bag and everything and he got his white freaking socks <laughs> yo check this out they're playing tic-tac-toe on the wall over here bro what they've been having like tic-tac-toe tournaments over here and stuff and you get you have these massage cards as well right here as we entered the elevator we don't even know which floor it is bro <laughs> So there's zero, one, two, three. All right, we just made it to the first floor. Is this it? Yo, guys, check this out. We made it to our um uncle's house right here. There's Omar right there. He's waiting uh by the door because if someone comes in, he's gonna scare him and prank him. You know. This guy, look at this guy. He's sitting down as if he's like some 40, 50 year old uncle who's come here to you know let. That was like that one uncle that freaking he fills his stomach up, okay, and then he he lectures. The freaking young kids about eating less. Wow, because you couldn't find a comeback, you're gonna lie down? Gee. Yo guys, we just ate and now we left the house. It's almost budget time, so we're gonna go to Machid and Nabawi. We're gonna pray Fajr over there, inshallah. But yo, the vibe outside right before Fajr is so crazy. Yo, we just made it to the parking of Machid Al Haram, bro. Machid and Nabawi, we're literally under it right now, bro. There's a whole parking space and everything, mashallah. Exit to Haram, bro. Let's go inside. Yo, this entrance looking kind of dope, bro. Look at these gold, uh, what do you even call these? Handle? Handle ba handlebars? You stupid. Bro, we just just climbed like three stories and there's way more stairs to go oh finally bro this is the last stair right over here guys as soon as we take a left from here 
Masjid al Nabawi is gonna be seen, bro. Look at this. Bismillah. Yo, check this out, bro. Masjid al Haram right over here in Medina. Actually, it's called Masjid Nabawi, but then we call it Haram as well, you know. Check this out, bro. It looks so beautiful. There's a rawba right over there. Right under that green thing is the Prophet's grave, you know. Bro, I haven't seen this view in such a long time. I'm so sorry, guys. The light is kind of messing it up. Like, you guys can't even see it properly, but then, you know, this is how it's done. Yo, it's Avan time. Yo, we're about to enter the masjid, bro. When the Avan's over, we're gonna go inside and pray, you know? Allah. Bro, there are so many people here, subhanAllah. This masjid is so big, bro. Check it out. Everyone's getting ready. They're getting their roads straightened so that they can pray sunnah, you know? Guys, we decided to settle down right beside this pillar right here because there's no other space, you know? Put our shoes right here. <sighs> minutes later Guys, we just left the masjid. Look at how many people there are outside as well. We just got done praying Fajr, bro. Everyone's leaving checked out. Everyone's gonna go back to their hotel room, go to sleep, you know, wake up like 10 days later. Right, these guys are so lucky, bro. Their freaking hotel is right next to the right next to this masjid. Like, look at these guys, bro. These guys' hotel, it's right over there. You see that building? Everyone lives over there. Check that out, bro. People are rushing to help lift the dead body so that they can get the ajr. Bro, may Allah just forgive them. Bro. bro, when you see stuff like these, it really saddens you and makes you, you know, humble and stuff. Yo, I wonder why people are queuing up over here, bro. There are so many people that are queuing up. What are they queuing up for? This is kind of weird. Anyway, bro, they're probably queuing up for something good. Why am I even thinking about it? Let's go back. We got done praying Fajr. We're gonna go back to the car now. We're gonna go home. And I know you guys must be wondering, why didn't you see the Prophet Sallallahu grave? Well, the thing is, Dawood's like, bro, I'm very sleepy and stuff like that. So, you know, because of this guy, we're gonna have to freaking go back home, sleep, and then come back here tomorrow, inshallah, to visit the grave, you know? But yo, they really take you underground. Like, look, this was one stair, right? Now we're going down again. Look, this is another stair right here. And we're going down yet again. And this is another stair. Let's go down again. Finally, we made it, bro. Here it is, bro. We made it back to the car, but no one's here. Everyone is, bro. I'm the first one. I'm always the first one when it comes to everything, bro. Every single one of my family always makes us late, bro. Literally. And I just never make anyone late, you know? I'm I'm literally such an I'm such a good person. Yeah, too bad. This guy is finally back, bro, after making me wait for such a long time. Anyway, guys, I'm gonna see you guys once we get back home. Yo, guys, that's where I'm gonna be ending the vlog. We just slept and woke up. So freaking crazy. Anyway, let me quickly give the shout out. Three, two, one. Shout out to you, TZ. Anyways, that's pretty much been it for this video. If you guys enjoyed the drop like, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Shout out, Assalamu alaikum.